Hello kids, how are you all today? Did you finish your homework? Did you say yes? Oh, that's great. Today, we shall learn a little bit of English. And what's that? Any guesses? Yes, that's right. We shall learn about a new topic that is called action verb. Do you know what an action verb is? Well, let me tell you about it. An action verb is a form of a verb that shows the act of doing. It answers the question, what? For example, Tom is eating. So, what is Tom doing? He is eating. Let me explain it to you using some more examples. Every Sunday, I go to the park with my parents. We all walk together and play in the park. In this sentence, there are two action verbs. Can you tell me which are those? Yes, that's right. The action verbs in this sentence are walk and play. It shows that you went to the park by walking and you played over there. Okay, so let me take another example. The park had so many flowers. The roses smell nice. In this sentence, there is one action verb that is the smell. It tells you that the roses have a very nice smell. The park also had a nice pool. It had many ducks. We kept standing near the pool and saw the ducks waddling. Well, this one is interesting, isn't it? So, can you tell me the action verbs in this sentence? Okay, let me give you a hint. There are two action verbs here. Yes, that's correct. The action verbs here are standing and waddling. It shows that while standing, you saw the ducks waddling. Are you enjoying it? <laughs> that's great. Let's learn some more action verbs. I saw a small puppy in the park. It was jumping near a small boy. The action verb here is jumping. It tells you that the puppy was jumping near the boy. Okay, now another one. The small boy had a ball and the puppy started running after the ball. Can you tell me the action verb here? Yes, that's right. The action verb in this sentence is running. It answers the questions, what did the puppy do? You guys are really getting to understand action verbs. Great, let's carry on. We saw the puppy running after the ball. It was looking very funny. So, we started laughing. This one is quite interesting. Do you want to try picking out action verb here first? Yes, there are three action verbs in this sentence. Running, looking and laughing. All the three words answer the question of what? Great work kids! My father bought ice cream for me. I started eating it quickly. Kids, can you tell me what is the action verb here? Well, the action verb in this sentence is eating. It tells us that you started eating the ice cream quickly. After coming back from the park, I started studying. I began writing in my notebook. I was also solving some maths problems. This sentence has four action verbs. Do you want to try? Go ahead. Yes, the action verbs here are coming, studying, writing and solving. They all tell us the things I did when I returned from the park. Action verbs are a very important part of speech. They tell us about everything we do. Now, do you know we are all surrounded by action verbs. From watering the plants to going back to sleep at night, action verbs are everywhere. So the next time you see your mother cooking food or your daddy talking over the phone, you know what they are doing. Now that you have already learned about the action verb, let me give you an exercise. Last Saturday, John went to a zoo with his classmates. In the zoo, John saw many colorful birds and butterflies. The butterflies were sitting on some flowers. 
the birds were sitting on the trees. There was also a monkey on the tree. When he saw John, he began climbing upwards. The teachers told the students to open their lunch boxes and eat the food. After eating, everyone started playing. There were some rabbits nearby. They also started hopping with the children. Everyone started clapping seeing the rabbit. How many action verbs did you find here? Can you name them? Think about it and quickly drop your answers in the comment section below. Also, if you want your friends to learn what you have learned today, don't forget to share this video with them too. Hit the like and subscribe button to stay updated whenever we come back the next time. Until then, bye-bye.